Here comes the plane. See these hairs here? The uh, silver white ones and the little bushy uh, furrow up behind my ear. I, I burned all those off with a lighter uh, 15 minutes ago. And now they're back. And here comes an airplane. Ooh, that silver one growing right there. These things sprout out of my face in fucking real time. Here's the path to sinus, they follow your sinuses. Even the lines in my skin aren't normal age lines, <laughs> if there is such a thing. I've had literally this, uh, this line right here on my forehead. They, they, I've had them like come and go, get worse, get better, get worse, get better, or not worse, but just more noticeable and less noticeable. And then um, I'm burning some stuff off the scrubby one day and, and I feel this snap like a, like a fishing line or something. You know, your fishing line makes a snap. And whoo, a, a fiber hair that long came right out of that groove and just whoo, floated away. There's more of them. They'll, they'll pull tight and that's what like pulls it, pulls the skin that way. Almost all the weird uh, things I've had on my skin of any kind, whether they're lumps or bumps or, you know, swollen or, or uh, sore looking, looks like a zit kind of, but it's not because there's no zit stuff in it. It's just, uh, it's all this shit. Hey, guess what? Here comes that plane. Mm. And my chin just seems to be loaded with it. I mean, it's one of the worst areas. I don't know what it is. I think it might, like, like the stuff, uh, builds up in your cartilage or something. I swear to God, it's like, it's like Jay Leno chin thing here going on, right? There's like a fatty deposit on your chin, which is, you know, normal to... But this is a little different than normal because it's a little extra swollen and, uh, you know, it tends to uh, be where the most fibers sprout from there and, you know, behind my ears and the very back of my head, which is, which is right here. Hey, check it out. Bringing on a plane out. Okay. Ow, 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 I can feel that on the very top of my head even. It feels like things are being, you know, like little lines are being broken off the very top of my head in a strange way. Like these uh, super thin fibers running around over your skin, through your skin, right? you know, and they cinch you up tight. And when you burn them, they snap loose at both ends like a string would, you know? Lovely. Looks like you're just getting old. Yes, I've aged 40 years in the last five. Wow. Budge. All right. Anyway, I'm here to do some work on some motorcycles. And as always, there's jetliners and small planes circling this place constantly. What's that? Oh, so check it. I, I sizzle my head and uh, what do we get? This thing, white, bluish white fuzzballs begin to appear, you know. Here comes another jet too. 
I swear, if there's no jets flying over at this any particular moment, and I and I like burn some of this shit off within minutes, one flies over. <laughs> like there's some sort of triggering mechanism. There's some sort of signal that lets them know, "Hey, somebody's burning their hairs off, sitting in a plane." <laughs> that sounds utterly ridiculous. I know, but ugh. this little swollen patch there. That's it to every bit of the swollenness from here, across here, here, these lumps on my head. I mean, you can totally see the black spots. This, uh, this one never goes away. And it pulses. It goes throb. Oh, what are these black spots? That, that's the stuff coming out. I'm at the wrong angle for a sun. Anyway. I'll be back.